when God doesn't answer. You have put me in the lowest pit, in the darkest depths. Your wrath lies heavily on me. You have overwhelmed me with all of your waves. You have taken from me the closest friends and have made me repulsive to them. I am confined and cannot escape. My eyes are dim with grief. Psalm 88 verses 6 through 9, New International Version. Psalm 88 is one of the darkest psalms in the Bible, written by Haman, one of King David's advisors. It is a psalm of utter anguish. Haman is dying. His friends and family have forsaken him. His prayers go unanswered. Darkness is his only companion, and Haman blames God. Maybe you have felt like Haman. There is certainly enough pain and horror in the world that it may seem like God is silent. Wars rage, justice is scarce, and greed runs rampant. Is God listening? As depressing as Psalm 88 is, we know that Heman's cries did not go unheard. How? The fact that it is included in God's word tells us that God heard. We can't understand why God allows suffering, that he does, but we know that his suffering is as great as ours. When it feels like God isn't listening, don't stop talking to him. He is listening, and He loves you even when it doesn't feel like it. Give Him your suffering. He can handle it. Lord, I can't understand you. Help me feel your love even while I feel this world's pain. God bless you all, and keep the faith.